and God has constructed a world that even an atheist, in spite of their foolish worldview, which leads to incoherence in virtue of their worldview, can make sense of certain things because they're living in God's world. How do we know which things atheists can and cannot make sense of? They can make sense of things in God's world to the degree that he permits it. How do we know what he permits or doesn't permit? How do we know what God permits based upon his revelatory actions? What, in what part of the Bible does God reveal that atheists can know about pizza? Um, God, God reveals from Genesis to Revelation that unbelievers can know certain things. For example, certain things about the, the physical world. That there's causality, that there's continuity, uniformity, regularity. Now, okay. you've asked me several questions. Now, why do you deny the existence of God? Why well, don't deny the existence of God? Okay. Um, do you lack belief in the creator-creation distinction that we call God? Yeah. Okay. Do you realize that the creator-creator distinction is a worldview? Sure. If you lack belief in any worldview, then you deny it by virtue of your worldview. What I just said is irrefutable. Sure. Could you just lay that out syllogistically? Whatever, whatever worldview that you lack belief in, you deny it by virtue of the positive affirmation of your worldview. That's not true. Um, do you accept the law of excluded middle? Yeah. Okay. Does the law of excluded middle apply to all entities and state of affairs? Yeah. Does it apply to worldviews? Sure. Okay. So then if you hold to worldview X, then you automatically deny by virtue of the law of excluded middle any worldview that comes under the heading or classification of not X. Sure. And so in this case, right. And so when you, when you, when you are not operating from the creator, creator distinction worldview, then you deny it. I'm just not convinced of it. I'm aware of the law. Okay, of I just, I just, ex I that. just explained to you very clearly and you're smart enough to understand. If you think you're going to bullshit me by pretending that you're not getting it, it's not going to go well for you. I don't stomach for very long people being disingenuous and deceitful with me. Okay. If your is your worldview not the creator creator distinction? Yeah, but I can also just uh, say yeah, but so what? now your view well, worldview is... your worldview is not the creator creator distinction. Yep, but it's not, also not the creator, it's also not, not the not creator. The don't over talk me. Your not worldview of not the creator creator distinction is a de facto default denial of the worldview of the creator creator distinction. No, because I just am not convinced. Okay, bye bye. See you later.